Hi guys, welcome back with new video. I am Salinder. This is my SLDevgo YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to show you guys how to create Tetris game using C++. I mean, this is the fourth tutorial of my Create Simple Game tutorial series. I think you had better watch my previous three videos. I have created three games in my previous three tutorials. So, let's go to the video. First of all, you have to download this SFML file. I'll put those links in my description. Previous all video, previous my tutorials, I I have talked those things. Now I am not going to tell those things. If you have any doubts, you had better watch my previous two videos. Now I'll open Visual Studio. Continue without code. Go to file, new, and project. Now I am going to create a project. C plus plus and console lab. Select console lab and next. I'll upload this project in my github and I'll put those links in my description. You can download it and try it. Project name Tetris Games and select location and create. Now create it building my project. Yes. After building your project, you have to configure some uh, things, add some DLL files into your project. Uh, now I am going to my workspace and I have to create SFML file. This is my workspace. Right click and create a folder SFML. Now you have to copy bin and include folder inside this sfml file i will copy these three folders and paste it which i created sfml file and paste it yes fine first step is done Now right click your project for project 10 go to properties now you have to add lib include folders into your project go to link and select additional library directories and now you have to select lib folder to go to your project folder and which I created a SFML file. Now you have to select clip folder and select folder. Okay. Now go to link and input additional dependencies and you have to type some things. I will type those things quickly as yes. those lines you have to write. You have to type okay mm. now go to c c slash css c plus plus now you have to add include folder inside usfml select folder and okay now you have to change configuration to release yes and okay uh, now you have to run and see what's it's working or not after that you have to add, add some DLL files into your debug folder this DLL files are in here uh, your uh, bin folder inside your bin folder space 
Jesus.
Jones, Noel Londergold. Now I will run and see where the output. Yes, it's okay. Now you have to tap those lines and those things. I will quickly show those things and run. Yes, it is also working, working properly. This is the code and now I will uh, insert all the images this is the code so this is the code of the game I will show it I come I, I'll comment all the lines you can understand it easily because of those comments Yes, this is the full code. I'll run. Yes, it's working. This full code I will upload in upload to my GitHub account, and I will uh, put those links in my description. You can download it and try it yourself. Yes, you can change the uh, design also using the arrow keys. I hope you enjoy this video. So there is a comment section. I mean you have any doubts, you can ask those things in comment section. If you like my videos, click in the like button and share my videos. Finally I like to say, don't forget to click subscribe button to get latest content from my channel. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.